God, what a horrible movie. I can't believe you had us watch this. Well, yeah, I did agree to it, but dude, what even was that? I mean, I expected something, but not all of whatever that was. Wait, 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 wait. Just let me get this straight. So they were wizards? Warlocks. Is there a difference? Oh, yes, I'm sure the directors needed to be that specific. So, warlocks. Magic, of course. Badly done magic, sure. I, but I get that part. What I don't get is why they were shirtless. When were they not? I don't think there was a single frame where everyone was fully clothed. Uh, there's no way we're going back to check. You close that stream right now. I need some time to cool down after watching something like that. Ugh, because it's bad. Don't you dare tell me it's so bad it's good. I said don't. <laughs> hey. I will begrudgingly admit that, yes, I did enjoy it. Nope, listen to me. Listen. Not the movie itself. It's because I got to watch it with you. You're the only person I'd endure that with. You're not getting my point. Ugh, the movie was terrible. You know it was. Ugh, I'm just never gonna win here, am I? Well, I hope you're feeling extra special then. Nobody else would ever be able to get me to watch that abomination. Those other movies were different. This will never turn into a guilty pleasure. Okay, sure. It can be yours. But I refuse to let it get farther than that. Shh, shh. Hey, <laughs> we watched it and it's done, so it's done. Okay? Say okay with me. Okay. <laughs> of course I enjoyed spending that time with you. Your movie choice was extremely questionable, but I made it through okay. Yeah, you better let me choose the next one. Uh, now that the movie is finished, do you need to head out soon? Like, do you have anything else to do? Oh, nice. Uh, since you're not busy, would you mind staying on a call with me for a while? I don't want to go to bed yet. It's late, but... Yeah, I, I don't need to be up early tomorrow. I can put that stuff off, don't worry. It's not super urgent. Right now, I just want to hang out with you some more. Isn't it nice when we don't have to go as soon as the movie ends? Nah, we don't have to do anything else. I don't need any crazy brain stimulation this late at night. Just keep doing whatever you're doing. I'm here for your company. I'm gonna chill. Mess around with my phone a little bit. Oh, but we could listen to some music together, if you really want something. Yeah, listen along with my Spotify. I'm playing the slow stuff, so uh, heads up, I guess. By the way, thanks for hanging out so much with me recently. It means a lot. Uh, you know how I am, I can't help saying it. Because yeah, it's not always the easiest thing to make plans with us. Uh, especially with this stupid time zone difference. Honestly, it's still like... It's still such a big thing for me when we get to spend time together like this. I know we talk every day, but that's just texting. Hanging out... Even if we can only do it through a call, is a lot more fun. Right? We've been friends for so long, it should feel natural by now. Maybe I'm broken or something. It still feels really special to me, even after so long. <laughs> You're right. You are the best. 
I'm always gonna agree with you. Don't test me. <laughs> you always get embarrassed about that. It's my only end when it comes to teasing you. I need to have the upper hand at least sometime. <laughs> Remember how it used to be? Yeah, yeah, shut up. I'm still weak to that kind of thing. Shut up! <laughs> hey! <laughs> Speaking of how things used to be, don't you think it's crazy how far we've come? Like, we've known each other for so long now. Think about it. I mean, yeah, I get sentimental a lot. That isn't unusual for me. We've never really talked about it like this, though. Through... not text, you know? That's how it started, isn't it? With you sliding into my DMs all cool-like? I bet you thought you were so smooth, didn't you? And now... We're stuck with each other. What a cruel twist of fate. <laughs> I wouldn't give it up for the world, though. Don't you worry about that. But yeah, all it took was that one little message to start all this. This massive shit show we call a friendship. <laughs> Fast friends is an understatement. I hope you know that. Seriously. I don't think I've ever connected with somebody as much, or as quickly as I did with you. No, 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 listen. Do you know how much I had to hold myself back when we first got to know each other? I just thought you were so cool all the time. Oh my god. Not just cool, but also, like, the sweetest person ever? Uh, and I'm just so pathetic compared to you. <laughs> See what I mean? Even now, you don't let me make jokes like that. You always have to throw your little compliments in there, huh? <laughs> let me make my jokes, <laughs> you ass. Well, maybe I've been calling you that so much because you've been acting like one. Ever thought about that, hmm? I'm only messing with you. Don't worry. Anyways, anyways. Back to talking about our past. Yep, I kind of decided that that's what we're going to do for the rest of the night. Because it's fun to talk about this stuff. Plus, we're super cute, so you should love doing this. Exactly, we are the cutest. So, do you have any stories? Oh no, I have dozens. <laughs> if you let me, I'll end up dominating this whole conversation. Well, if you're really gonna let me go first... Um... Okay. So you know how we have our pinned messages? Yeah, I know, fucker. Lots of them is embarrassing stuff you use against me. <laughs> That's not my point. No teasing now. I was saying... Way back when, kind of early in our friendship, I used to... Uh, how can I say this without sounding ridiculously clingy? <laughs> uh, when I was doing nothing at work, or maybe when we weren't talking because of the time zone difference, I would go back and reread our previous conversations. And I'd, uh, I'd screenshot it and stuff to read later. B because they were funny, or sweet. And it made me feel warm inside and shut up. Hey, shut up. Oh, why are you laughing so much? You're just gonna tease me about this now. So I'm the weird one? It's really not that common? Don't say it's cute. <laughs> really? We're seriously gonna deep dive into this one thing? N not just for our chats. I also have the, uh, uh, the voice messages we send each other. Like, remember the birthday things I made for you? And then you sent me birthday messages as well? I still listen to them on occasion. 
Sometimes I want to hear your voice, okay? Especially if we don't get to hang out for a while. You better still have my messages saved. If you lost that birthday stuff, I'm not going to be responsible for my actions. <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? What are you saying? Oh. Oh! Oh my god, you fucking sweetheart. You even remembered what I said in them. Uh, look who's the gooey romantic type now. Of course I remember what mine says. I also remember having a really shitty birthday that year. But I was able to talk to you the whole time, which was one of the best parts of that day. I don't know what it is about you, but talking to you always makes me feel better. No matter what was going on, it still does. I guess you're just that great. Nope, 100% sincere. You are that great. Yeah, you mean a whole lot to me. Which is crazy stupid obvious by now. I think I've lost track of how many times I've told you. <laughs> what can I say? I like doing it. I'm the type of person that... I really like talking about my feelings. Or, I like to let the people I care about know how much I care. So you're on the receiving end all the time. And I gotta be honest, your reactions make it so worth it. <laughs> Sometimes you get so flustered. It's very cute. All I'm doing is being sincere and you can't seem to handle it. <laughs> it also gets you to open up a lot more. And you know I like that. Those conversations are usually the ones I read a lot. I haven't stopped doing it, no. I actually, uh, I actually saved a screenshot from our chat yesterday. Scroll up and take a look. You'll know exactly what it is when you see it. Yeah, when we were doing those quizzes and talking about love languages. See? Flustered. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I think it's pretty cool that we can talk about things like that, though. I mean, we talked about some serious relationshipy things. Very introspective and all that. True. What kind of friends would we be if we couldn't talk about that? I feel like it's... We haven't ever seen each other in person, right? But we talk about stuff like we're way closer than people who met online. Maybe it's because we're so far away that it's so easy? Or maybe we just have a naturally high affinity for one another. If that's a thing. I don't know. <laughs> uh, you're underestimating how easy it was for me to get to know you. I wanted to talk to you all the time. And you let me. Never heard you complain about it. Guess you were just as head over heels for me, huh? <laughs> I'm only teasing. Or am I? Wow, rushing me along here. I'm getting to my point, relax. Um, I think I was saying... Yeah, day in, day out, the messages were just flying. And a high affinity or attraction or whatever. We've talked so much, you know that? Since we met, I haven't talked to anyone else as much as you. Time zone differences and everything, we kinda never stop talking. Right? It's weird when we don't talk to each other. And honestly, with you in my life, I've never been like... I've never felt alone. Obviously, yeah, I have my friends that I see in real life, but but with you, it's uh, something else. I think, as crazy as this might sound, you're the reason I can't be lonely. Which, is that bad? I don't think it is, but I'm the one saying it, so who knows. I don't know. I'm saying these things to someone who's a million miles away. I'm exaggerating, sure, but 
You know what I mean. Long distance or not, you're always there for me. I can always talk to you. And we get to do that so often. <laughs> it's pretty difficult not to feel this way about us. I'm not alone in thinking this way, right? Oh, thank God. You let me do a whole lot of talking. I got a bit nervous. I did say that I like talking about my feelings, but we were getting close to feelings territory and you, you weren't saying much, hence the, um, the, the nerves. <laughs> yeah, uh, feelings, feelings, that kind of stuff. Of course I have feelings, what? Oh. Oh, um. No, no, we can... We can keep talking. All I've done tonight is blab about how much you mean to me, so... Yeah, we can keep talking. Well, I won't say it's something I haven't wondered about. I know we have our whole inside joke where we act like we're a married couple and all that, but, uh, has the idea ever crossed your mind? Like, us being a little bit more than this? I'll be honest, early on I did have, like, a couple of passing thoughts about it. Just random what-ifs, you know? I don't think that's really out of the ordinary. Yeah, it's not the weirdest thing. And it's not like anything would come of it. We're so far away. Is that not a problem for you? Uh, n not with me, necessarily, but yeah. Really? But what about... Don't, don't you think it might get a bit difficult? Trying to be that close with someone you can't even visit regularly? Oh. I guess you do have a point there. No, you're right. I even said it myself. We're super close for people who met online. So, would you be open to something like that? I mean, I would. I'd actually really like that. I don't think I'd really be asking if it wasn't something I wanted. Oh, I might have a small, tiny little bit of a massive crush on you. You know I'm not the most experienced when it comes to relationships, but this has been on my mind for a while now. Like, the way I am with you, compared to my other friends. And how every time we hang out, it makes me want to spend time with you so much more. <laughs> it's actually embarrassing. Even just seeing you show up online is enough to make me smile. So I guess... Yeah. I think... I might have fallen for you. Despite how far apart we are, you're one of the best parts of my life. You make me really happy. Oh my god, you have no idea how good it finally feels to say all that out loud. <laughs> to you instead of... Uh, never mind. <laughs> I told you, I'm not experienced with this. I didn't know how to act on my feelings. I didn't even know what my feelings were. And now I don't even know how we're gonna do this. Our long-distance friendship turned long-distance... Girl... Fred, this new, The new thing we're doing... Hey, don't tell me to say it. I'm still kind of nervous about what's going to happen. It's not like I can be with you physically, but I still... I still want to be yours, you know? Yeah, you're the one I want to be with. But, like, how? Should we just keep doing what we're doing and see how things go? Okay, but then... More calls. And we're hanging out way more. As much as our time difference allows, of course. And, uh, can I... 
can I call you like babe and and love and all those other cute names? I mean, yeah, <laughs> you have to do it too. And I'm still coming to visit you this year too. So then we could do like real dates and stuff. You could even kiss me or whatever. I'd really like that. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I was just mumbling. Shut up. Of course I want to kiss you. <laughs> Are you done teasing me now? Because I want to be sincere now. <laughs> so can I, you fucker? <sighs> Thank you for giving me th the chance to talk about this. I didn't expect things to go this way tonight, but uh, I'm really glad they did. Huh? Oh, yeah. I guess I was the one that brought it up. No, I swear. That wasn't my goal in the beginning. At the start of the night, you made me watch that god-awful movie. How would confessing be on my mind after that? Original plot line, my ass. It sucked and felt like it was gonna lead into something R-rated the whole time. No, 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 hush. Are you trying to ruin our love story with your bad movie? What if I just went to bed, hmm? How do you like that? Ha, <laughs> I knew it. You don't want to chase me away. You love me. <laughs> I should probably head to bed now, though. It's crazy late. Oh, I doubt I'll be able to sleep. <laughs> I'm really giddy about this. Oh my god. <laughs> I guess I should at least try and get some rest. Yeah, okay. I'll hop off call now. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Or later today, actually. Wait, before you go, I, uh... I don't know if I can do the goodnight love yous like I always do. Uh, things are kind of different now, so... Okay, no, you know what? Fuck it, fuck it. I love you. I love you so much. Okay. Oh my god, I can't, I can't. Good night.